Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to Observation. Um, yeah, let's get into it. No time to waste. I'm not sure how much of this I can take. They're just hanging there. Well, UC2 is pressurizing just now. Let's try to contact them in the meantime. Assuming they aren't all dead. Oh, that's right. There's another station. Look, I know this makes no sense. And you'll probably just give me some broken response. But I'm glad you're here, sir. So are you. One more time, Sam. Voice authenticate. Okay. Emma Fisher, one four zero four one two. That that don't look right. Because you're epic. 2026? That's in three years. We're online. That's almost in two years. See. Well, we still have some work to do if we want to speak to anyone. This is still true. The comms looks good, but the array is facing the wrong way. So, looks like to get a signal out, we are going to need two things. First, we need to adjust the array to target the other station's relative position from ours. Okay. The astrophysics lab may have some answer to that. Secondly, our broadcasts won't go anywhere without the captain's authorization code. I'm guessing we can find that in his personal module. Yeah, probably. EAS7. EAS7? Do you know what the authorization code is so that I can enter it into the system? You will need to set up the comms array yourself, though. Okay. If there are any new station alerts, be sure to let me know. I may be able to action some repairs now. Okay. The AS-7. Find rescue station coordinates in astrophysics. Astrophysics. Set coordinates in SAM OS comms. Broadcast the message. Okay. U E. How do I open? Ah, space. Right. My camera keeps bugging out and glitching everywhere. Camera offline. Uh, okay. How, how do I do this? <laughs> Station alerts. Oh, it's E. It's R. Duh. Emma, my cameras in EAS-7 have failed to initialize. Weird. Maybe Jim turned them off. That's fair. Come on, me just eating. Try them now. Is there going to be a dead guy in here? I hope not. Probably. Good. There's not a dead guy in here. Mission data eyes only. Um. Ugh. Jeez.
I want to connect here. Graduation? Add system link? I'm clicking. It's not working. Add system. I can't. I can't add that system link for some reason. That's really weird. Um, photograph of Jim Elias. Okay, two thousand eight. How old is this guy? Melfi unit? What is a Melfi unit? What? Melfi cooler configuration report. Use user Elias Jim. Logged in, switching menu configuration, switching menu sample type, selection cryogenics slash organics. Success, Melfi cooler now configured for organic matter storage. That seems a little suspicious. That would explain... That might possibly explain why something... why we're still alive. Perhaps we fell asleep. And by we, I mean Emma Fisher. Unless Jim is asleep somewhere. No, Jim's dead on this, on this, uh, on this, what's it called? Station. Marker observations. <gasps> Summary of daily observations of marker. <clears throat> okay, so they're observing something called a marker. Prepared by the EASA observation. Control group. Marker research center. Summary of marker observations. Solar region summary. Okay. 20, 26, February 17 at 4.30 p.m. UTC. Region, location marker, characteristics, helio spot, spot, mag, no, date. These are all weird. End of data, further data not available, conclusion, proceed as planned, target date remains February 17th. So this was yesterday in game? Confirm. Team members, Jim Elias, William Stafford, observation review group. Okay. I didn't give me any info. Excuse me. Um, I, excuse me. K 
Can't seem to find any info. Insert. I can't, I can't insert partly. Is it? Um. Well, surely there's some information in this, right? Graduation. Oh, is it 2008? Wait, go back. I bet the code is 2008 because you graduated 2000. Oops. He graduated 2008. Yeah. Mission authentication code precursor one. The code is precursor one. It appears to be a mission code. Precursor one. But that's not a mission code, Sam. Precursor one. Well, it seems to work. That's the auth coding. Okay. Uh, find rescue station coordinates in astrophysics are you O four. So I need to go to the Russian arm. Go four. Jeez. Okay, uh, we're doing this. Uh, S. Three. W? Oh, okay, that was right. Infinity. I forgot what the other ones were. I was not. I was trying not to have a seizure. Okay, that one. So four D one. Getting awful close, buddy. How did? How are you getting in here, anyways? Ricochet. Stacks. Flag. Oh, and the council table. Ricochet. Stacks. Flag. Council. Okay then. All right, time for the most jarring, not jarring. This is really confusing to me. Last time I played. Um, and when I watched Jacksepticeye play it, I still didn't understand what the heck was happening. I don't know if he understood what was happening. Send data co to comm systems. Near field, offline. Far field, I assume, is going to be offline. OK. 
Okay. Go back. So, do I need to turn... I turned on the things. Near field. Field. Okay. Well, I the, the near field was the rescue station was quite obvious. Communications. Communications is... I think that's what I wanted. Array coordinates and authorization key required. Goodness. Forty eight, eleven, eleven. Broadcast. What do I want to do? Router. Broadcast station. Return to last location, select move what? Confused. Oh. Sam, that's a good sound. You've got to start the business. I had to select Emma, apparently. Here goes nothing. on board observation please respond this is observation i have visual please respond if you can hear me please let me know in some way it's um it's just me left and sam i'm not sure how we ended up here there was a massive power outage, some noise, and then we ended up here. I'm assuming you know all this if you're here to pick us up. Repeat, this is Emma Fisher on board observation. Please respond. Sam, that alarm. Is that an incoming comms message? It must be the rescue station. It can't be ground control. It's, it's too quick.
Um... Okay. Now I've listened to both. Get in your sphere. I would be well. Actually, I'm pretty useless otherwise. I I'd just be. Where they had to jump from one spaceship to another, they use the explosive decompression of a module to throw themselves across. Ah. <laughs> you can just aim and gently push off. Mm -hmm. And I can honestly say, now that I'm in that situation, there's no way in hell I would trust my trajectory to an explosion. You know what? So that's where you come in. Where am I going? What? Oh, look at her. I can see her in the background. What the heck? She flew through the sphere. Okay. You ready? You you're in my way. Um I don't think she has an oxygen tank on unless it's some super high suit high high tech suit it's super high Are you coming with, or did you just die? Oh, okay. This is only my second time outside the station. And now I have two stations. Talk about jumping off into the deep end. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. She's not tether, then that freaks me out. Okay. And she doesn't even plan to be. That's us tethered together for the jump. Well. If I start to drift, you can try to course correct in the sphere. I'm not sure the science is spot on, but it's better than nothing. You can be my anchor. I don't know if that's how that works, but, uh, here we go. Oh, okay. Here goes. And she starts to freak out. Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Am I doing? Oh god. And yoink. You still with me, Sam? Yep. This rescue ship is identical. They must have built a secondary station. 
Yeah, two fully built stations. We, I'm gonna hit that. I'm gonna hit it. Here we go. Oh, it's so cool. That cable's having a lot of fun. I can't do anything, by the way. I literally cannot do anything. Also, why did you have the biggest tether ever? I can't do anything. I, it's literally a cutscene. <laughs> or at least, it seems to be a cutscene. Oh, hi. You're really close. Like this module doesn't use much. This is crazy. It's the exact same design. I thought they reused sections of existing stations for observation. There's no power by the looks of things. Guess you will be my light, Sam. I think I'd prefer you up front anyway. Straight ahead, then. Nice and slow. Oh, joy. What are you doing back there? Um, I don't like the field of view on this thing. Hmm. Also, I can't open that hatch for some reason. Use box? Can I respond? Watch, at some point she's just gonna appear behind me out of nowhere. She there? What the heck did I run into? Oh, the wall. Duh. There she is, just ominously standing there. I can't do anything. No response. Ah. These hatches are not connected to my system links. Of course, Harry. Is that gone? I'll try to budge them. There you are. Evo. Give it a good crunch. There you go. I know for a fact I'm gonna get grabbed. This is so weird. It's identical. So much for us being a flagship. The hatch ahead is open. We can access Universal. Josh, do you read me? Where are you? We're here. Sorry, I keep doing that.
a random helmet. This is real creepy. Ooh, windows. Wow. Pretty. I don't have a map here. So, I don't know where I'm going. And I don't exactly know where I've been. I just looked at that laptop. Am I in here? Yeah, I think we just came out of this, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I have no connection to the UN3 ULB hatch. Emma, I require your assistance. Uh, yeah, on it. Okay. The black goo. After you, I suppose. We're gonna cut it there. Uh, about the halfway, uh, half hour mark. Uh, thank you for watching. If you like this video, leave a like. If you enjoy this kind of content or you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And when you do subscribe, ring that notification bell so you never miss an upload. Uh, until next time, hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.